I love the direction that fashion is going in um, because you just see um, so much diversity. Um, whereas before, you just saw a, you know a size two or a size zero tall blonde girl on the runway. But now, um, Winnie Harlow, who has vitiligo, you see her, um, and you see models who are albino. You see uh, full size, plus size models, short models. Um, you see um, just everyone is on the runway and I'm loving it. I, I love that we have all beautiful hues of brown and black on the runway. Um, I'm, I'm just loving the movement that's happening in fashion and um, I think it's just going to continue to um, go in that direction. I think the standard of beauty is starting to shift and starting to be more inclusive and um, starting to show just the wonderful um, melting pot that America is and I just look forward to seeing you know more people um, open up their minds to uh, the movement that's happening and hopefully what's happening in fashion will translate to government and the, the political climate that we currently have is just not it. Um, I, I want to see you know more people um, open up their mind and start to be more accepting of others that may not uh, be like them and it's just it just makes for a better world when we love each other you know and we embrace each other not saying that you know you have to be just like someone uh, think like someone or act just like someone but just be able to appreciate uh, the differences that um, that we all share because uh, at the very basic level we are all human and we want the same things we want to be safe we want to be happy we want to be loved there's so much division out there and it's unbelievable and I just you know I just hope that people heal and know that even though we might not speak the same language we might not look the same we might have you know different levels of uh, income or you know just whatever the differences are I, I hope that people can reconcile those differences and 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 cherish life because it, it's precious and um, we're all just out here trying to survive and you know we just we just, this world needs healing, and I'm just, you know, I'm hoping for that.